This one's based on requests. It's also pretty awesome. We've come up with a lot of different ways to cross over water, but only one way goes under. And so we're all on the same page. Almost all underwater tunnels are in the ground below water, not floating in the water. Here's a look at some of the world's craziest underwater tunnels. First up is the Esteroy Tunnel, or really that, if you want to try to pronounce it. It was completed in 2020 in the Faroe Islands, an island state between the UK and Iceland that's technically part of Denmark. The tunnel is almost seven miles long, and it connects not two, but three different places. How? They put an underwater intersection in the middle, technically a roundabout. The clever design cut travel times in half for most of the population. If you've been to Hong Kong or Macau, you might have taken the Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge, HKZM for short. 34 miles long, it's the longest sea crossing in the world. It combines 20 miles of viaducts over the open water with three separate thousand foot plus bridges, a four mile undersea tunnel, and four artificial islands that connect them. Drivers go from high above water to down into the water and then back out above it in about 40 minutes. Not only that, but they also switch from left hand to right hand driving while on the bridge and then switch back at both ends. Last but not least, the Bun Sightseeing Tunnel connects two parts of Shanghai in style. It technically uses the same tunnel as the metro, but for about 10 bucks you are treated to a light and sound show to make your crossing a lot more fun. Hope that wasn't boring.